you hear it crashing through the trees. There's no way to escape it. The sloth bear is the most dangerous bear in the world, and it's going to tear your face off. Here's how to survive the deadliest bear. Sloth bears are found throughout the Indian subcontinent. They are not related to sloths and are certainly not slow. They were named by zoologist George Shaw for their sloth-like long claws and unusual teeth. Sloth bears don't seem all that dangerous. They are surprisingly small, weighing only 136 kilograms. They are also not meat eaters. They have long skulls and small gap teeth that are ideal for eating insects. But when provoked, sloth bears are vicious. They can easily maim or kill a person and boast the highest per capita human death rate of any bear species. Sloth bears kill dozens of people a year, though many of the attacks go unreported. They're also notorious for tearing open the faces of their victims. That's one face off you'll want to avoid. If you get attacked by a sloth bear, should you try to run? Why could scaring it off be a bad idea? And how can lying down save your life? Step 1. Steer clear. Sloth bears do not hunt or feed on humans as part of their usual routine. They only attack in self-defense. However, they are extremely protective of their cubs. They are known to go after anyone who gets too close to their offspring, which will remain under their mother's watchful eye for up to a year. If there happens to be a heat wave underway, sloth bears may also wander into populated areas in search of water. And as humans expand further into their habitat, potentially deadly attacks will only increase. It's better to be safe than sorry. Do not venture anywhere near areas where they've been spotted. And whatever you do, don't leave food in the open as it could attract them. Step two, listen and make your presence known. The worst thing you can do to an unsuspecting sloth bear is surprise it. If you find yourself in the vicinity of one, try to make as much noise as possible. Consider wearing a bell. Yes, really. This will avoid startling the bear and causing it to attack. If you have to go into bear territory, travel in groups of at least three. Never go alone. Also, keep your ears open for any odd noises. When feeding on ants and termites, sloth bears use their lips and tongue to create suction and vacuum up their food with a distinctive slurping sound. Step three, don't run. If you encounter a sloth bear, do not turn your back. Absolutely do not try to run. A sloth bear on the move is extremely fast and can hit speeds of 32 kilometers per hour. Keep facing the bear and back away slowly. The last thing you want is for it to charge. If it does, hold your ground for a moment. It might be a bluff. As tempting as it might be, do not try to climb a tree to escape. Sloth bears are excellent climbers and aren't above scaling a tree after you. Step four, play dead. Trying to fight off a sloth bear is a bad idea and tends to result in a greater chance of sustaining serious injury. If a confrontation is inevitable, your best bet is to drop to the ground face down. When the bear reaches you, try to cover your head with your arms to minimize damage. Yes, you might still be hurt, but if you keep your head and face protected, you'll increase your odds of surviving. Scream for help. There is strength in numbers and others may arrive to help scare the bear off. If the bear starts to lose interest in you, play dead. If you can convince it you're not a threat, it might leave you alone. Remember, it has no interest in eating you. Five, don't hold a grudge. Sometimes people will hunt sloth bears in retaliation after a life-threatening encounter in an effort to seek some sort of revenge. Do not do this. Sloth bears do not attack people out of malice, only instinct. Let it go and be thankful you were able to walk away from a sloth bear attack. But sloth bears aren't the only deadly creatures you should be wary of. 
Lions are bigger, stronger, and faster than you. Could you scare one away by staring it down? Find out here on How to Survive.